Measuring headphones is uh, much more complicated than measuring loudspeakers. <laughs> loudspeakers have clear conditions. That means we have the speaker, we have the microphone, we have uh, the measurement equipment. That's it. The difference to headphones is the human being. We have to measure the impact and the influence of the ear of the person. And this is the big difference because uh, human beings have totally different ears and totally different receptions of sound in their ears. Here we are sitting now in our diffuse field measurement room. I think there are not many rooms like this, but for us it was very important to build one because we want to learn more about the individual reception of sound by a headphone. Yeah, the idea behind the room is that we create a so-called diffuse field. We have eight monitor loudspeakers in this room. They radiate different frequencies at the same time. And due to the construction of the room, by the reflections and absorbing materials, we have a really diffuse field with constant sound pressure. The testing person listens to the sound, remembers the sound pressure, uh, they receive and then take on the headphones and listen to the same frequency band and decide is the sound louder or is it less. And this is done over the entire frequency range. After this testing, the test run will be processed four or five times. After the test run, we receive a curve for this individual person. Then we get the next one in, get his curve. And we go on with 30, 40, 50 of uh, different testers. And then we build the average. And then we can see, is this headphone uh, preferring certain uh, areas of frequency? Does it more or is it less? So then we can adjust it in the development, increase or decrease, until we have a linear response of this headphone. That's the way how we develop it. So we do not measure the headphone directly. We measure the result the headphone creates with individual livings.